Okay, the community in Ovia Northeast local government area of Edo State where residents have called on the state government to, as a matter of urgency, come to their rescue and help facilitate the renovation of the only secondary school in the community. According to the community, the call became imperative as the present condition of the school poses a threat to the education of their children and wards. Nabisa Bello completes the report. These are some of the classrooms in Ogede Secondary School. Located along Upper Ekenwa Road in Ovia Northeast local government area of Edo State. The appalling state of the school prompted the community leader, His Royal Highness Usadebame Ahaua, to appeal to the state government for urgent intervention. He said he regretted that the community has been neglected over the years, leaving the people to their fate. It is true that we have secondary school, we have primary school. We have a health center, and this community is recognized by the state government. But as it is, we do not have any government representative. We do not enjoy anything from the government. We do not have any government support. The secondary school we have in this community, if you go there, you will see how it looks like. We have written to the government. We have called on the government but we have not been able to get a reply from them. Other residents who spoke on the issue expressed displeasure over the poor condition of the learning environment and other public infrastructures, adding that most of the existing classrooms were put in place with the efforts of the community leader, residents and parents to make sure their children still have a school to attend. A lot of things are going on there where the children are not happy, no, no chairs, the roof is not there, and the two class they have, they so, it's so congested. Even the, all the, even the one they have not removed, the entire side is totally wrong. It's totally, no, 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 it's not, it's not good for, for students to learn. So what would you mean that this is what the government should come to her aid? And these are what they said the children should enjoy because of our future. So we want the government to please come and visit the school. If you see the school now, we are spending our money to patch the zinc and the, every other thing there. So we call up the government, they will not respond. We need the government to take proper care of the school. Government looking at the school is not a good environment for children to learn. We don't cry, cry, we don't tire. So the children now don't, they waka waka, they know they sit yes, down. No toilets, no bedroom. So they don't even they care for them. No, they don't try best. The government can help us repair the school. Make teachers, better teachers still. They made them put chair. This boy away, not they so. Make them put some. The question begging for answer is: With the pathetic state of Ogede Secondary School and many others, will the recent promise made by the state government to bequeath a legacy of quality education and better workforce that is required to survive the fourth industrial revolution be fulfilled? Nafisa Bello, Trust TV News, Benin.